Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. We are going to do some yoga. I am at this beautiful stadium. I am actually on my cycle right now, so I've been trying to open my womb area. When I am on my cycle, I work with the lower three chakras, which is the solar plexus, the sacral chakra, and the root chakra. The womb is a space where we need to heal as women um, from past relationships, uh, your mother's trauma, your grandmother's trauma. If you did not know, uh, for women, you were also in your grandmother. We have our eggs when we are babies. So as my mom was a baby and her mom, she already had her eggs, so meaning she had me and all these things. So it's, it's the generational things that we have to release um, and that's what we should be doing on our cycle. Um, that's a beautiful time to work with that energy, okay? So, as a divine feminine, it's some, sometimes hard to um, truly remain confident within. And um, that's just because there's societal beliefs of how women should look, act, be. Uh, but in all actuality, you can be whoever you want to be. Don't let people tear you down. Make sure you always breathe too. Breathing is so important to ground yourself. Grounding takes patience, time. We're gonna just sit back on our bums. <laughs> yes. I was gonna tell you guys the time. It's 9.38 a.m. So good morning. Grand rising, actually. Um, it's really nice being out here and just soaking up this beautiful Johannesburg, South Africa weather. So, yeah. Um, so I want to work with, like, lifting my hips. Um, I'm going to lay my head back down and make sure we're lifting only the hips area. Have that balance when you are doing this. Don't put too much pressure on either area of the body, your upper body and your feet. Allow yourself to really focus on the move and squeezing your glutes. This is going to not only give you a fatter ass, but it is going to help you ground and make you feel more balanced. You're balancing the lower and higher chakras, the yin and the yang, which is harmony and balance and understanding both aspects of the body. Rock side to side. Uh, if you wanna make some noises, please feel free to do that. No, and it's okay, I feel like women are scared to do the happy baby because it's like oh my legs just spread wide open it looks so inappropriate no i'm stretching you should too you should do happy baby because we're all babies why are you thinking it of in a way of sex like this is literally a fucking exercise like what you know then we're gonna bring both of them up and we're gonna rock We don't have to rock up, we're just rocking. Rock, rock, rock. You are my rock. Tailbone there, that right there. It needs some pressure. It needs that pressure. Um, because that area is like super sensitive. That's your root chakra. And your root is a super sensitive subject. A lot of people don't like to talk about where they came from. And like, I know where I came from and I can never forget that. Um, I, but I embrace those lessons I had to learn. And life is a lesson, but like it wasn't all lessons. Good times, you know, okay times and like those love languages. I had to understand that as a child growing up in a world where you don't know what the fuck is going on. It's okay, like I'm learning, I'm growing. I am once again in Johannesburg, South Africa. I'm not gonna stop saying that because I went alone. I'm safe, I'm protected, I'm love, I'm abundant, I'm joy, I'm happiness, I'm grace, I'm beauty, I'm 
dependable i am like building a strong foundation i'm understanding where i want to be in my life and it really doesn't matter how someone else feels about it because i feel a hundred percent about my decisions you know so and that's all that matters period period all right now we can get on our knees yes yeah, like to do this so getting on your knees is honestly the best thing ever like i love being on my knees because i ground myself let's let's think about that before we think about sucking dick all right let's be real <laughs> but grounding And here, you can move however you like to move. Okay, let's get flat back again. Now we're going to rise our uh, knees up just a tiny bit from the ground. Hold still. Ah. Uh. And release. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. We're going to um, center a hand like you can do the right or left. You're going to breathe up. And we're going to open that heart chakra of yours. We're opening. And when you do any work, any inner work, any shadow work, anything that defines that self care loving yourself and embracing yourself you have to open that heart to actually receive it like you can do work on the root but you got to open that heart i want you guys to really just breathe on this one we're gonna do the opposite side make sure the hand is centered and then you breathe going up Okay, let's see. Yeah. I feel I feel open. We're opening. All right. The next thing we're going to do is lift your leg, right? I don't know how to get in this perfectly, but I like doing it this way and then just opening your leg up. So, do you want I can redemonstrate. I basically came from here. I am putting my foot up. And then I'm lifting a leg up. Okay, cool. And this is what you call it, I think, frog pose. And we're going to open those hips. Open it, yeah. And we can um, put some pressure on the ground. Like, you have now three hands to work with. And you should be balancing, putting, separating the energy, separating your pressure on both that one leg and these three legs <laughs> or three arms, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Ah! <sighs> yeah, we're opening. Now you can release by either hopping up. Yeah, we're going to do that one actually. And then we're going to go to halfway, lift, halfway fold, and release your shoulders. I always forget, like I have to remind myself when I do this, the halfway. And then go back down, put your head down, and wiggle your upper body. Allow yourself to sway. And then we're going to go just touch the ground again then we're going to do the opposite foot so I had my left foot up here and now I'm going to do my right foot up here so put it to the side of your hands and then you're going to release this foot 
in the back of you, okay? <sighs> and give it some good distribution of weight. That's what it is, weight. Uh, things could be so heavy, and I'm like, these words, weight, I don't like to say weight, because it really doesn't even freaking matter how much I weigh. It's none of your freaking business. I look good. I know I do. Thank you, you know? So make sure you are balancing your pressure, I feel like, in both areas so it's not too heavy. And we can lift back up by putting your foot up. Uh, and I don't know if I said this at the beginning, but bend your knees when you're in this position. I sometimes forget. I get it. Head down, upper body. All right, now we're going to breathe in and rise and release. I like to work with my hands. We're gonna just do this. Make sure you breathe. Release down. Inhale up. And release down. My hands are my tools. I embrace my hands because they do so much for me. They drive me and they make my soap for me <laughs> they do so much they be putting in fucking work in overtime you know they cook my meals they cut my fruits they hug they embrace myself they pleasure they do so much and because I have hands, I have to show appreciation of my hands. They're gonna take care of my future baby. They're taking care of me. They're taking care of the people who I love. Your hands are beautiful. So embrace them. There we go. Now that we are like, have, we have opened our hearts, we're opened our wings. We can do it this way, if you guys like to. Breathe in while you close and out while you open. And if you know Reiki, you should be able to feel a ball in your energy points. This ball can create anything. Literally, it's so fun to play with <laughs> energy in general. But whenever you open your arms, you should be able to feel your heart expanding. And whenever you close, you should feel it, you know. Collapse, not collapsing, but like closing for sure. Anyways, did you want to join me? Let me finish my video. Okay. I hope you guys like this womb opener and me talking about the chakras. If you want to see more content like this, subscribe and check out more of my videos. Okay.